This month marks the 30th anniversary of Hackney City Farm. The Gazette went down to the farm to find out how it had developed over the years. We spoke to CJ, who introduced us to the animals. Hi, this is Hackney City Farm. My name's CJ. I've been here for six years. Three of them I've been working. So ever since I was 14 and I rolled up here, I've always wanted to work for animals, specifically farm animals. Um, just because, you know, they have a purpose, we have a purpose here by educating the public and, you know, it gives you a lot of satisfaction from, from knowing that. So Dylan here, what, this big boy, who's yeah. slightly overweight, we'll say slightly, um, is one of our bottle feds from a few years ago. He's ended up being kept because he's so friendly um, and he's good for when we have children about because yeah. he'll go right up to them, give them a cuddle. He, he, gets a lot, he gets a lot fluffier before then, don't you? Oh, he's lovely. It's like a big dog. Well, for many years before we had Clover the donkey, Larry was a bit unsat, you know, he was very, he was unhappy. I mean, donkeys, they're, they're they bond for life. They're, they, they like companions. So even though he had sheep and goats around him, he still wanted, you know, <laughs> a yeah. mate or a girlfriend or whatever you want to say. So when we, when we decided to get Clover, it took quite a few months for us to s decide, like, which donkey we wanted to get. And when we came across Clover, we thought, oh, she's perfect. So when we finally got her here, it was so nice to see that he would be happy, you know. Yeah. And they've been inseparable since, so they're the, they're the reason I work here, because I want to work with animals. This is my first time coming to the farm, and we are really excited to be here. Um, yeah, we like it. We would like to um, stroke the pigs. It'd be cool to like, be able to go into the pens a bit more.